All right, for whoever asked for the video on this excursion, here it is. I can't believe we have neglected to not do a video on this unit in the past, but here it is. This excursion is a 6.0 power stroke turbo diesel, which has been bulletproofed and has had a ton of the popular 6.0 work done. If you look at the description, I did not read it ahead of time and I should have, but the description says everything has been done. This truck came from a very good customer of ours, just like a lot of our vehicles. I know we say that very often, but we have a loyal following of customers. And he builds a truck a year, or truck every couple years. Matter of fact, if you go on our website, our big F650 monster truck project came from the same owner. And we've had countless other Super Duties and other trucks that have come from him as well. He's just a gearhead at heart, loves working on projects, and he took this one on as a very intense project. So what does it have other than the crazy orange fully coated exterior it also has quite a bit of powder coated items underneath a dual steering stabilizer system it has the high mount track bar system which is adjustable it has the high crossover knuckle system and as you see underneath of this one is not as shiny as most of our trucks we did not put any paint or undercoat because there was nothing to hide or cover up you've looked at excursions you know they're usually rust buckets this one is not the undercarriage is very solid you can see some surface rusting right there but rocker panels are excellent everything underneath is good traction bars toyo mud terrain tires 20 inch wheels 22 inch wheels tis off-road they're in good shape has actual rear leaf springs, has polished front and rear differential covers. Again, the long length traction bars. Worn upgraded front hubs, premium lifetime warranty style. Doubled up front shocks with powder coated mounts. This also has the 05 front end. So the grill, bumper, and headlights have been changed. It has the newer style grill, I mean, newer style mirrors. Here, two tone limited interior. Bottoms of the doors are in good shape. You can see this was obviously originally white, it was probably a white and tan two tone, if I had to guess. A little bit of wear on the armrest. I've driven this truck home a couple times. It is a good driving truck for its size. I mean, you know, it's big, uh, but it drives well. Four captain's chair system. All the door locks work. We've already put the lock actuators in as they do go bad. Removable rear seat. Overhead rear entertainment system. Rear tow hitch. Heated power memory seats. Parking assist. Tow hitch receiver. Aftermarket badges. factory super duty style side steps and i did say memory seats that's a pretty rare option matter of fact we had a customer that would not buy one of these one time without that feature it took us forever to find one that had that feature but upgrade exhaust and all the stuff under the hood again you'll find all the details about that on the website davis4x4.com or davisautosales.com also in the back of the truck we do have a matching set of tubular arms that mount right here and run up to right here unfortunately they do make it ride bad but if you were going to do any kind of like off-road or pulling they do stabilize the front axle they do look cool if you're just using it as a show truck but other than that you don't want them on the street they ride like crap you can see right there brand new drive shaft which is extended to the proper length an extremely nice undercarriage this truck's not for the faint of heart. It is very odd that it has the full liner coating. But good news is it has protected this truck. The undercarriage is in great shape. Before we sell it, if somebody would like us to put an undercarriage spray, paint, or undercoat, we will do it. But again, we just didn't want to hide anything. You can see the original sticker right there on the hitch. 
I would have to dare say 80 to 90% of these trucks are rusted to pieces and nothing left. Um, this is not one of them by any means. Uh, excursions just were extremely notorious for rocker panel rust. Cab, well, it's not really a cab corner, but a rear door section rust right here. And this is what we call a dog leg. And this one is not. A little bit right there in the rocker where the paint has chipped off, but very moderate. About the only objection under it at all. Nice looking truck. Big old SUV. This one is 24.9. If you know the price to do this equipment on these trucks, this lift kit, tires, wheels, diff covers, uh, you probably... Well, you got eight to ten grand there. I think he said he spent four thousand to have the body coated. Another couple thousand for the front end conversion. Obviously, you got to value the excursion for something, and then all the under the hood work that he had done topped out right at ten. Also, so just between the line X, the lift kit wheels and tires, and the motor alone, you're talking asking price and getting an excursion for free. It has had some calipers done, and it does have the braided brake hoses. So nice truck ready to go check it out on the website any of the other rides we've got in stock and when we do these videos always remember this is only a portion a lot of these vehicles are kept inside one of our showrooms one there big one across the street big one beside it getting ready to take place so don't forget very much more than meets the eye and a lot of stuff is indoors so if you come by after hours a lot of the nice vehicles are tucked away just ask if you don't see it sometimes they're down at the off-road shop sometimes at our other storage building and most of our boats have been put away now since we are starting to get a little bit cooler temperatures so if you're looking at any of our boat inventory or rv or camper inventory also don't just assume because you don't see it please make sure to call and ask Telephone number right there and website. Those are ours. Let us know how we can help.